saying the only true God is God the Father. Yes. Now, if that is a statement Jesus but is making, he, he, could he possibly say that he's God? Yes. But wouldn't that contradict his statement? No. Okay. Because, you know, it is like me saying, because, it is like me saying, you're the only one with a bag here, and then I'm saying I've got a bag as well. Yeah. Wouldn't that be a contradiction? No. No, but that, that's the wrong analogy for this. Why? Because God, the Father, Son, and Spirit are God in themselves. Where does it say that in the Bible? I, I don't know. It doesn't say I it? I need, I need to get better. Okay, so until I, you find that, it, yes, find okay. the evidence for that, okay, that's let's fair. put that on the side burner. Let's, let's deal with what is already examples, in the Bible. The examples I would give would be the John 1 examples. And John 1 has got nothing to do with the Trinity, trust me. Do you not think so? No. Okay. In I, fact, even I the divinity of Jesus, even the div divinity of Jesus would be questioned if Jesus is claiming that he has a God. Say that again? If Jesus is claiming that he has a God, then even the divinity of Jesus would be questioned. Shall I tell you why? I, I, I'm not I, Okay, I'm let not, me ask I'm you. Let me, your, let me rephrase your, the question. Your, your, can God have a God? I know you're getting no. Does Jesus have a God? No. When Jesus says, I go to my father and your father, my God and your God, what do you understand by that? Say that again. Jesus, in John chapter 20, verse 17. Yes. yes. Oh, I don't have my... Yeah, sure, go on. Read it from the Bible. The reason the reason I read it from the Bible is that I can understand... No, no, that's fine, that's fine. ...what, what context you should, you should, is. You should always read it from the... First. Is she carrying a naked man on a cross? Claims to be Jesus. Uh, give me the verse again. John 20. 17. Um, Jesus said to her, Do not cling to me, for I have not yet ascended to the Father. But go to my brothers and say to them, I am ascending to my Father, and your Father to my God, and your God. So when Jesus says, My God, what do you understand by that? That he is God. No, he says my God. Yes. He didn't say I am God, he says my God and your God. Yes. Does Jesus have a God? No. Jesus was he telling a lie when he said my God? No. What do you understand? Do you, look, look, it's, it's very simple English. And I don't mean to be condescending. When you say, yes, I'm going to my father. Yes. What do you understand by that? I am going to my father. Your biological father, right? Yes. In that sense, in your, in your context. Yes. Would it mean anything other than that? Not that I can think of. Okay. Now, use the same language which Jesus uses. Yeah. If you say to me, let's say you are, I don't know, on your deathbed, and you, death is now imminent, and you're saying, I'm going to my God. Yes. Can it mean anything else other than that statement, that you are going to your God? Well, so, I will answer no, and then you're going to say that then that's what Jesus was saying. Yeah. So you tell but me what does Jesus mean when he says, I am going to my God because, and your God? Because I didn't say why. I'm asking you what does it mean he when is, he says, I am going to my God. Yes. No, I've not yet ascended to my father and your father, my God and your God. Yes. So. I I will I'll do, I will read this slide. No, no, read it. Okay, read it now. Read it now. I'm not telling you give me an answer right now, but read it now and tell me what you understand when he says, "I go to my God and your Do not cling to me, for I have not yet ascended to the Father. I go to my. So that's after his ascension. No, no, before, before, before his ascension, after the crucifixion, but before the ascension. So I've not yet ascended. Yeah, yeah, he's not yet ascended. He's not yet ascended. Yes. Do not cling to me, for I have not yet ascended to the Father. Yeah. But go to my brothers and say to them, I am ascending to my Father, and your Father, to my God, and your God. So what is he telling Mary Magdalene then? To that go to your brothers, go to my brothers, and tell them what? That I am ascending yeah. to? to God. To, to my, he says my God. No, he says first, my Father. My Father, yes. yes. And your Father. Yes. So which Father is he talking about? Both their fathers. So whenever I pray, I no, pray no, in, my in, Father in, and in Father. In this context, in this context, which Father is he talking to? Um, who, who was he talking to? No, no. Which Father is he referring to? I have not Heavenly ascended. Father. Heavenly Father. So the Heavenly Father is the Father of whom? Whose Father is he? 
he is God the Father. No, no, whose father? Who's? Je- so he is God the Father and Jesus is God the Son. No, no, no. So he is I didn't ask father. you. He is the I didn't ask you who is the Father, but the Father of whom? Whose father is? He is. He is no one's biological father. I didn't ask you biological. Whose father is God the Father? He is our Father. When you say our father, does that include Jesus? Is he Jesus' father as well? Spiritual father? No, because... Je- is Jesus our son if he's our father? Say it again? If the God father is our father, is God son our son? No, wait, wait, you're confusing him more. Let me ask yeah, you this. Sorry, sorry, when, sorry. When, when he says, I go to my, go to my brethren and yes, tell them, I'm, I'm ascending to my father and your father. So when Jesus says, I'm ascending to my father, yes. he's referring to yes. Jesus' father, father, heavenly yes. father, yes. Yes. and also the father, yes. Yes. the same heavenly father is the father of his brethren. Yes? Yes. yes. So the same father, his brother, his disciples, uh, yeah, his disciples, his uh, followers, whatever it is. So the same father is the father of Jesus and the father of the disciples. Yes? Because we are in Christ when we are... I'm not asking you why. Just okay. understand the, the context first. Yeah. Then we understand the reason. And then he also says, I go to my God and your God. So when Jesus says my God, means that Father is also his God. Yes. Is that tr- is that what you understand? Um, so he is God. Who is God? Je- Jesus is God. No, in this there is no mention of Jesus being God. No. Okay, so please do not bring your baggage into this, if you see what I mean. Yeah, Let's stick to the passage. Yeah. So when Jesus says, I go to my God, is Jesus claiming to have a God? I would say no. Then you are being dishonest. Okay. Either you do not understand in, in, the clear language spoken here, because just like you, you understood my father, you understood that very clearly, isn't it? Yeah. That the father of Jesus. Yeah. You did not have a contention this. But as soon as Jesus mentioned in the same passage, my God, your heart cannot accept that. You know why? That's right. You know why? Because you, it is something called cognitive dissonance, where you have the truth, but you cannot accept it. Because you have this baggage of the Trinity always weighing on you. So you cannot see, even from, the, from your own Bible, you cannot see the fact that Jesus is claiming to have a God. When he says, I go to my God and your God. And the reason why is because Jesus is, is God. So he's not God. I know, I know we disagree. The Bible doesn't claim that he's God. Jesus so, doesn't claim that he's God. So, so why would you say he's God when the Bible doesn't claim it and Jesus doesn't claim it? So that's the second question. The first question, the reason why I, I find it hard to accept yeah. is because I believe that Jesus is God. Based so on the church. Therefore, yes, so whenever you, the, the teachings of the church, you, yeah. you take yeah. that in, you take, but also because I have I have accepted Christ as my savior. So therefore, anything that, that would suggest that I am going to be very, very taken back into Christ, right, which I am, and that verse, that is good. I will go and look at that, and that is something that I will have to, to read and look into. Yeah, that's that's good. And, and, and that 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 is why that is why I find it hard. But so that that is. Yeah. There are two verses yeah. you need to look at. One is John chapter twenty verse seventeen. Okay. Yes, in which yes. Jesus claims that he is going to his God. And second, John chapter seventeen verse three, where he claims the only true God is the Father. I'll, I'll take a note of that. Okay, so you got so two clear cut verses from the Bible, yes. which, where Jesus well, curious, claims that he is God. I'm curious to see what others think of that. Yeah, sure. sure. You know, no so problem. That, that's why I would, discuss it with your Christian friends. Yeah. But you know, look, from my perspective, from my understanding, and from my uh, John twenty seventeen and John seventeen three. John 2017 and John 17 3. I'm talking about these three. Both in the Gospel of John. Okay. Yeah. Most of the time, you know, most of the time you'll get the get the response of what the church is saying, what the church is teaching. Yes. 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 Which, like I said, was the Trinity doctrine established nearly well, I, I will look, uh, 350 I will years I, after Jesus. I will, I will first of all look at, at just the scriptures and see what what the context it falls in, what Jesus is saying, because that is, that is very difficult for, for someone who has put their trust 
yeah, in Christ absolutely. as God? Because that's what you have been have an name trained to do. Yeah. Uh, for, for, this, um, for this, you need to uh, put aside your bias. If you yeah. put aside your bias yeah, of course, of and course. seek truth, whatever yeah. whatever you um, yeah. is your conclusion yeah. is good for you. With yeah. sincerity. Yeah. With sincerity and so, uh, bias is against yeah. sincerity. Shall we, shall we leave it there? Yeah, sure. What's your name? Thomas. Thomas, I'm Hashim. Very nice talking to you. Wa alaikum salam. So, inshallah, God willing, um, you know, just like you probably might have realized that we have looked into the Bible. Yes. yes. We have studied the Bible. Yes. Would you be willing to look into the Quran as well? I, I have a Quran at home. Yeah. Do you read it? Um, it is an English Quran. Right. I, I don't read it that often. Okay. Why don't I you. Are you based in London? Where are you? No, I live in Northern Ireland. Oh, you're Ireland, okay. Irish. So, uh, no, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not coming to any studies because I'm not here. You came all the way here and just for the so, No, I was, I was over on Friday for work and then, I see, I see, I see. And then yesterday I went to see, went to see the Gunners. Oh, Arsenal. 2 0 against 2 0 Chelsea. Oh, Chelsea, wow. <laughs> so, uh, so that is. Oh, okay, okay. I've had a good weekend. I must have made a day. I'm flying home. <laughs>